Hey guys, so um, I'm just making a random video about ferrets, so I hope you guys like it. Um, so I guess what most people ask is um, like, I don't know, like what, I don't know, what is a ferret? <laughs> uh, a ferret is uh, their personalities, I guess. They they want to know like how, what do they stink, um, what their diet is, uh, what kind of treats they can have and stuff like that. So I'm going to make a short little video of some stuff, some nice little tips. Um, my ferrets are both sleeping so I'm not going to bother them and I know you really probably want to see a ferret. If one of them wake up, I'll go over there and grab them. Um, so a ferret is from, I think, what... I read is the weasel family. It might not be the weasel family. I know for a fact it was um, one of the families that they're from is the uh, uh, Tasmanian devil. And um, if you don't know what a Tasmanian devil is, it's like a really big weasel. And they kill like everything. Anything that gets near them, they just kill it. So, um, Basically, what ferrets uh, are supposed to look like is like little tiny weasels. And they're supposed to be used to like go rabbit hunting and stuff. And there still are a lot of ferrets that do do that. But the ferrets that you get here, they're bred especially for um, pets and stuff. Not a lot of people go hunting with their ferrets anymore. If you want to get a ferret that hunts, you probably want to go and get it out of state like in the UK or something or Australia because they actually have ferrets that they breed there to you know get the size that they need to be to actually hunt. Um, ferrets, uh, let's see, they do have an odor but I think mostly, I mean I have a specific um, ferret uh, shampoo that I have that I use um, it's the green tea. Uh, it's it smells really good. They I give them a bath. I you're not supposed to give them a bath except for like twice a month. But the um, shampoo that I use for them it keeps their natural oils. So I give them a bath at least once every week or once every two weeks, um, depending on how bad the smell is. Uh, and it keeps the smell down pretty good. Uh, you can get deodorizing stuff like um, like sprays and all that, and um, the sprays help a lot. Um, I clean their cage every day. You have to clean their cage all the time, every day. Um, now my ferret, <coughs> my ferrets, they do run around the room, so they're not always like boxed up inside this cage. <coughs> they like to run around and. Um, they don't they do know how to use a litter box um there is a specialty uh litter that you can get or you can use cat litter either one's fine um i think they prefer the cat litter because uh i haven't tried it myself but from what i've seen is they prefer the cat litter just because it actually smells like something that would keep um their scent from using the bathroom in it uh, but I don't have that. I haven't used it. I started using Critter Litter, and it works pretty good. I mean, uh, my Snowflake knows how to use it. We got a new ferret. She doesn't know how to use it yet. She's just a baby. Um, but, uh, yeah, so they do have an odor, but you can fix that very easily. Um, let's see. Their diet needs to be watched. Uh, they have to have specialty food. Um, I mean, as long as it says ferret food on it, I mean, I would suggest getting it as long as, uh, you look at it and make sure that it has, um, specific proteins in it. Like, if you get a ferret, or if you have a ferret, and, um, the vet says that it has to have a certain, uh, stuff for its diet, I would suggest looking at what it needs, and then going to get the best food for that ferret. Um, I just use regular ferret food. Uh, it's uh, just crunchy, advanced nutrition. 
and I just use that. Um, it looks like cat food, literally. <laughs> uh, let's see. What else? What other topics can I cover? Uh, they're very playful. They have a puppy dog attitude. Um, it's like a having a baby puppy that's like a month old, but they never grow up. They can learn tricks. They can learn how to sit up. They can learn how to, I'm pretty sure you could teach them how to stay. I haven't seen a ferret do it, but I'm pretty sure you could teach them how to stay. Um, you could teach them how to play dead. You could teach them how to hop like a bunny rabbit on their back feet, which is really cool. I just saw that earlier. <laughs> um, and, uh, I mean, uh, to be sure, uh, I'm going to put a link below. And there's this website that helped me a lot um, just today that I found it um, about, you know, just basics on ferrets and uh, their health. And if you have any questions, you just type it up in the search box and uh, the people actually answer it for you. And um, I mean, it just gives a lot of facts about ferrets that really helped me. So I'm going to put it in the link below and uh, hopefully you guys can uh, check it out. Uh, let's see. Well, I mean, that's pretty much it. Um, so... I'm going to try to get my ferrets out here in a second, and I'll see you guys again later.